there's a lot of talk these days uh, about getting all these people off employment and support allowance and uh, income, I mean, incapacity benefit and onto job seekers allowance. And it was reported, uh, I think, in June or July that nine out of ten people uh, going through the work capability assessments with Atos Medical Services, so called, uh, failed those medicals. And it turned out in July that I was knocked off from employment and support allowance. The uh, guy gave me zero eligibility points on all criteria and so my benefit was stopped. He didn't even look at the letter from my, uh, you know, I mean, from my vocational support advisor or the medical stuff from my doctor and I've since managed to get that overturned by way of a letter from my vocational support advisor and so on 13th of July, I mean 13th of August, Job Centre Plus wrote me saying that my benefit was being reinstated uh, from 12th of July 2009, uh, your employment and support allowance will be £64.30 a week and uh, blah 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 how the money will be paid into my bank account and uh, not once does it mention when the payment would go out or from what time the benefit would go out and as it turned out the payment went out on August bank holiday Monday 31st of August, didn't, I no, mean, left me uh, in arrears on the 1st of September. The uh, money didn't clear till Friday. Uh, where are we getting this information in our great newspapers? And uh, my 32 year old niece had it even worse. She uh, has severe anemia. Uh, she was uh, waiting about two or three months before they sorted out her appeal by way of a tribunal. She's getting medical uh, treatment two or three times a week. And uh, yeah, she was told, you're ready for work. And I... Uh, in 2004-2005, Job Centre Plus call centres failed to answer 21 million incoming calls. That's 44% of all incoming calls. Where do we get that reported in our main newspapers? And uh, I. Mm, I guess they've yet to catch up on the paperwork of that. And when I was told your benefit is being stopped, after all the hassle that I've had through the years, I quite frankly thought of uh, pressing the self-destruct button. But uh, through being disability spokesperson for the Green Party, I have a constructive channel with which to uh, energise myself with my rage and unite with others and I like to thank those of you who have been very supportive to me as I have been supportive in having a role. I'm also a computer skills learning coach to adults. Uh, not getting a penny for that, but there's enormous job satisfaction. 
I fail with job interviews with the kind of uh, pressures and anxieties of that. And so, while well, there is a Job Centre Plus website, I believe, still called worksforme.com, uh, the essential thing is what works for me. And it's the Green Party, not the Welfare Reform Bill. And education is wasted on market forces. <laughs>